Welcome to the world of rodents. These fascinating creatures play crucial roles in ecosystems, such as dispersing seeds, maintaining soil health through burrowing, controlling animal populations, and serving as important herbivores that manage plant growth. However, their rapid reproduction and potential to spread disease can also make them a nuisance, especially when they invade human environments. So let's dive in and take a closer look. Rodents are one of the most diverse and widespread groups of mammals on the planet. They belong to the order Rodentia, which includes more than 2,000 species, making up about 40% of all mammal species. From tiny mice to large capybaras, rodents can be found in nearly every corner of the world. But what exactly makes an animal a rodent? The defining feature is their continuously growing front teeth, called incisors. These teeth never stop growing, so rodents must constantly gnaw to keep them from becoming too long. They gnaw by using their powerful jaw muscles and sharp chisel-like incisors to cut through various materials like wood, seeds, and even hard surfaces. As they gnaw, the upper and lower incisors rub against each other, wearing down evenly and keeping the teeth sharp and at a manageable length. This behaviour not only helps maintain their dental health, but also allows rodents to access food, build nests and defend themselves. As mammals, rodents share certain characteristics with other members of their group. They are warm-blooded, meaning they can regulate their body temperature regardless of the environment. As mammals, rodents give birth to young, feed them with milk and are covered in fur. Many rodents also have whiskers, those sensitive, hair-like structures around their mouths and faces. These whiskers, or vibrissi, are highly sensitive and help rodents navigate their surroundings, especially in the dark. Types of rodents. Rodents are incredibly diverse, with many different types, ranging in size, habitat and behaviour. Here are some of the main types. Mice and rats. Among the smallest and most common rodents, mice and rats are found worldwide. They often live close to human environments, which is why they are frequently seen as pests, causing damage to crops and stored food supplies. However, despite their reputation, they also play important roles in natural environments. For example, mice and rats help disperse seeds, which promotes plant growth and forest regeneration. They also serve as a vital food source for many predators, such as owls, snakes and foxes, helping to maintain balanced ecosystems. Squirrels. These are medium-sized rodents known for their bushy tails, often adding a touch of colourful life to our forests, parks and gardens as they leap from tree to tree. Squirrels are typically tree dwellers and are commonly seen gathering and storing nuts for the winter. Their habit of burying nuts and seeds, especially acorns from oak trees, plays a crucial role in seed dispersal. Many of these buried seeds are forgotten, allowing them to sprout and grow into new trees, contributing to forest regeneration and biodiversity.
beavers. These larger rodents are known as ecosystem engineers. Beavers build dams and lodges using sticks and mud, creating wetlands that support a variety of other species. Their behaviour of gnawing away at trees can drastically change ecosystems, often in a beneficial way. By cutting down trees, beavers create open spaces that allow sunlight to reach the forest floor. Encouraging new plant growth and increasing biodiversity. Their dams also slow water flow, reducing erosion and forming ponds and wetlands that provide habitats for fish, birds and other wildlife. Guinea pigs and hamsters. These small rodents are popular as pets due to their friendly nature and ease of care. Guinea pigs are social animals that thrive in groups, while hamsters are more solitary and enjoy burrowing. Capybaras the largest rodents in the world. Capybaras are native to South America and can reach the size of a small dog, weighing as much as 65 kilograms. These social animals live in groups, sometimes numbering as many as 20 individuals and are typically found near rivers, ponds and marshes. Capybaras are semi-aquatic and are excellent swimmers using water as a refuge from predators and to cool off under the hot sun. They have webbed feet that help them navigate through water with ease and they can stay submerged for several minutes, even sleeping partially submerged with only their noses above the water. Capybaras play a significant role in their ecosystems by grazing on grasses, helping to control plant growth and maintain wetland habitats. Porcupines. Known for their quills, porcupines are rodents that use their sharp spines as a defence mechanism against predators. They are primarily nocturnal and are found in a variety of habitats, including forests, grasslands and deserts. Porcupines are herbivores and have a diet that consists mainly of leaves, bark, fruits and nuts. Dormice. These tiny rodents are known for their ability to hibernate for long periods. Dormice are often found in Europe and live in trees or dense shrubs. They have small, rounded bodies and sleep for several months during winter. This variety demonstrates how rodents have adapted to nearly every environment, from forests and wetlands to deserts and urban areas. Rodents play important roles in ecosystems around the world. They serve as prey for many predators, from birds of prey to larger mammals, and help maintain the balance of natural food chains. Additionally, rodents such as beavers are known as ecosystem engineers, building dams that create wetland habitats for other species. Even small rodents, like mice and squirrels, help in seed dispersal aiding the growth of new plants and trees. They also contribute to soil health as they burrow, helping aerate the ground and mix nutrients. However, not all interactions with rodents are beneficial for humans. Some rodents, like rats and mice, are considered pests, especially when they invade homes, farms or stored food supplies. Their gnawing behaviour can cause damage to buildings, and they can also spread diseases through their droppings or bites. Rodents also reproduce quickly and their populations can grow rapidly, making it challenging to control infestations. In conclusion, rodents are an incredibly diverse group of mammals that play both helpful and harmful roles in ecosystems and human societies. From their unique teeth to their sensitive whiskers, Rodents have evolved in remarkable ways to adapt to a variety of habitats. While some may be pests or carriers of disease, others contribute significantly to the balance of nature and even amaze us with their unique abilities and behaviours. Understanding and respecting these animals allows us to appreciate their place in the natural world.
Don't forget to subscribe.